UTSA's longtime president on administrative leave, rumbling the foundation of the institution and leaving students divided about their university's future. Ricardo Romo was pace, placed on administrative leave today for allegations of misconduct. As the night team's Courtney Friedman reports, this comes just six months before he's supposed to retire. For 18 years, he's been UTSA's lead roadrunner. Probably the most respected person on campus. That's why many students were stunned to hear University President Ricardo Romo was put on administrative leave. Administrators only said they're reviewing allegations about his conduct, but would not elaborate. It takes me back because the school is highly respected. Many say in great part because of Romo, whose goal was to make UTSA a tier one and division one school. Since Romo got here, he increased the faculty from 400 members to 1400 members. He's always at all the events like you see him just mingling with everyone. Romo already planned to retire in August and students like Samson Matthew don't want to see him leave earlier. But others seem fine with the president making an early exit. There are some issues that I've had with the university itself that he's um, failed to address and so I, I, I really don't I can't say that I'm that surprised. Maureen Khaki looking forward to changes in leadership. I think we need to work on uh, <laughs> De definitely budget improvements for our professors. That's one of my main concerns for the campus. As Romo's potential uh, misconduct is reviewed, the search for his replacement continues. The school hoping to fill that coveted position by September 1st. Courtney Friedman, KSAT 12 News. And while Romo is on administrative leave, Dr. Pe Pedro Reyes will step in as university president. Reyes is the special assistant to the chancellor and professor of education policy at UT Austin.